Welcome everybody to a brand new video. I'm your host Dark, and we're back in Gmod again. And as you've probably already seen from the thumbnail or the title, we're gonna be running into some creepy creatures this video. I actually installed a mod that adds a bunch of zoology, zo zoola, a bunch of creatures from Lights Are Off on TikTok, and apparently one of them is actually down here inside of this subway station. Now I'm smarter than the type of person that would go down there and investigate by themselves. No, 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 no. Instead of that, we're gonna send in a drone. So we're gonna send this drone in there and see if we can spot one of these creatures. We're gonna see how creepy they really are. And then we're gonna try to catch it. Oh, well, I just flew into a wall. Uh, this ain't starting that well for me. Oh, okay. Why am I lagging, bro? My PC is literally on its final legs, bro. Give me 10 more videos on my PC will actually explode. All right, so we're down here in the subway tunnels. We got this tunnel that goes to Central Square. And then we got a tunnel over there that also goes to Central Square. Well, I guess both these tunnels go into the same direction. So it doesn't really matter where we go. Oh, you guys hear that? Are those sirens? Hold on. How much, how far can I fly this drone before I lose reception? I'm actually not that sure. Wait, we made it into another stop. I don't think we can go further than... Oh, <laughs> I may or may not have just lost the signal to my drone. I'm going to have to go down there, aren't I? All right, that drone was very expensive, guys. Uh, did I fly? Wait, <gasps> yo, maybe I can wait for the train. Wait, why? Why is that thing not moving? Yeah. <gasps> what the heck? There's somebody in there. Wait, this is weird. Hold on. Do I have signal over here? Please tell me I can connect to my drone. Shoot, it's too far. Wait, what? Hold on. There's another metro. Aren't they gonna crash? Oh, this is bad. Guys, look away. You're not allowed to see this. <gasps> oh, it stopped just in time. Boy, what the frick is going on here? Something fishy is happening, guys. How exactly is that train just standing still like that? There's something under there. Did, did somebody owe oh, money to Wall Street or something? Ah, oh, shoot, this door's kind of locked. Oh, oh my god! Oh, that was close. That was close. All right, they just crashed into each other. Oh my god, they're glitching. I don't think this is supposed to happen, guys. <laughs> Who the heck glitched this train like this? <gasps> Hold on, guys. I think I may or may not have found something. Let me let me remove this thing right here. And let me remove all of this. Oh! Uh, <laughs> that was, um... Ow. Painful. Incredibly painful. <laughs> you guys see that? I think we actually found one of the creatures. It must have glitched everything. Hold on. Let me clean up the map so everything is normal again. This time I'm gonna send in the drone, but, um... I hope the monster isn't going to be on the train tracks again. Because uh, it'll literally glitch everything. Alright, so if I'm not mistaken, it should be right here. Y'all see those legs? So, oh my, is it sleeping? Hold on. It kind of looks like it's sleeping. So this is the cat creature. I've actually played the game. If you haven't seen it on my channel yet, that either means you didn't click on it. And that's mean. Or I haven't posted it yet. One of those things. But yeah, this is the cat creature. Uh, I'm pretty sure it moves in packs. So if there's one over here, there's probably a bunch inside of the tunnels. Let's see, does it move? Oh, it doesn't move. Oh, wait, it does move. Hmm. <gasps> wait, where's it going? What the heck? Okay, that's kind of weird. It looks stupid. Did y'all see how stupid it looked? Falling into the wall and stuff? Let's see what happens if we go down there. We gotta save it because it's gonna get hit by the train again. Oh, <gasps> there it is. Hey there, buddy. Hey there, buddy. Oh my god, it's fast. Hold on. Let me do a little speed test on this thing. How fast is it? Hold up. Ah! Oh, yeah, that's valid. It's pretty fast. Did y'all see that? That Metro car didn't even have a chance to hit me. <laughs> they were literally faster than the train. Are you serious right now? Okay, let's see if we can get out of here. Ooh. What the heck? What kind of... Wait, this is crazy. What kind of train station is this? I've never seen this stop before. He's kind of dumb. He can't get out. Let me help you out, buddy. I'm just going to put you over here. Come on, dude. Come on. Bruh. There we go. That's better. All right. Now, let's see. Can you go up here? Can you go up here? Up here, buddy. Up here. Up here. Come on. What the heck was that? I must have installed a mod that makes this game bloody. I don't remember what mod that is, but like that was disgusting. And I also spawned in an entirely different area. That's fine. All right, that cat creature, I didn't like it anyways. Let's grab our drone and see if we can find any other Zula... Zula... Creepy creatures. 
Okay, let's just call them creepy creatures. All right, my trusty drone. We're on another train station. This right here is Hillside Station. I don't think we're downtown anymore. So we got the train passing by over there. Let's see if we go this way and follow the rail. Oh, look at that. What kind of creature is this? Now, what the heck is this? It looks just like the cat, but it's got like bear ears, like teddy bear ears. It's got siren head's body. What is this supposed to be? This thing, this, this looks more cursed than the cat, in my opinion. Hold on, let's go over there. Let's get a closer look. Yoinks. Oh my god, it's making my game lag like crazy. Y'all seeing this? Dude, that thing is so tall, it almost reaches up above the elevated tracks. Y'all see that? All right, so he looks like Siren Head. I think he's supposed to be a bear. Or maybe he's supposed to be a cat, but I, I don't think cats have ears like that. Let's see what it's like if we become him. Ugh. I don't like this at all. Look at the way he moves. He, he's the size of this light pole. Can he run? Okay, so this is the normal walk. And this is him running. And this is him jumping. Yo. That's wild. That is so unnecessary. <laughs> Why can he jump that far? There's literally no reason for this bear to be able to jump that far. I'm pretty sure I could jump over a building. Should we try that? These buildings look pretty high. Let's see if we can go over them. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> it wasn't even hard. No effort at all. Light work. No reaction. So what kind of attacks does this thing have? It spawns something simple like a zombie. Let's see what kind of damage it'll do to the zombie. Oh, yeah. Insta-kill. I wonder if it will actually attack the cat. I don't know if these animals have like a hierarchy. So if we spawn the cat over here and we got the bear over there, will they fight? They won't. They're not fighting, but I'm pretty sure I can make them fight. All right, so right now uh, I changed some things, so they should actually start fighting. As you guys can see, the cat has a special attack called uh, a headbutt. And then the bear literally just uh, slaps him around and I'm pretty sure he kicks him sometimes. I saw him do a kick attack a bunch of times. He won't do it anymore. Oh my god, this looks so cursed. Ugh. Who the heck made these creatures, bro? Get some help. It actually looks like they're similarly powered. I mean, the cat looks just as powerful as the bear and vice versa. So I'm not sure if anybody's going to be a winner in here. And they probably have like a million HP as well. So if we just stay, stay here for like 10 hours, maybe we'll get a winner. So while they're fighting, I'm going to go ahead and uh, spawn one of those nukes. Let's see if they can survive that. So we got um a gas canister right here. I'm going to put it right in the middle of them. So I'm going to put this thing right here. I'm going to put this thing over here. The bear is going to go down here. I'm going to enable this. And the idea is they will probably attack it. I didn't realize it would explode if I touched it. Um, We should get a different bomb that doesn't do that that's probably a good idea this bomb this bomb should be good are they gonna attack it oh oh they almost hit it oh my god come on. i can't believe they didn't hit it oh come on okay i guess i'm gonna do it then oh oh back 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 up back up back up what the heck it didn't explode are you serious right now okay i guess i'm gonna have to throw it on him okay yoinks dude usually these bombs they go off if you just fart in their general direction and now this thing won't even go off if I shoot it. Huh. Ah. That is wild. I don't. I think that it's a dud. I don't think it works. <laughs> Never mind. It works. All right. That nuke um, almost crashed my PC, but we got the cat back and we got the bear back. I actually check what this is, and yes, it's supposed to be a bear. His name is Monster Bear or something like that. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna spawn these guys right here. We're gonna see if they can break into my house. Like right now. Oh my, oh my god, they're fast. Oh my god! Bruh. I should turn off that mod. Because I feel like this video will not make any money. <laughs> I gotta fly all the way back to the other side of the city. Because I forgot to set my spawn point. Let's go ahead and put a spawn point right here. So we'll actually respawn here. And what I was planning on doing if I hadn't been killed. Oh my god, my body is still here. Oh, what? The, is that my skull? Is it that big, bro? Where's my jaw? I don't have a jaw. Oh, my. Those are my guts. I'm so sorry y'all had to see that. Let's uh, just throw this somewhere where nobody Yay! will be bothered by it. That's good. All right, there they are. What I was going to try out, though, I was going to see if they can break into my house. So if we close this gate. All right, let's see. They can get through the gate. <laughs> okay, we're going to have to build some better defenses, bro. Especially since there's going to be way more, way more of those creatures showing up soon. Let's wait for them to leave first. Can you guys leave? 
Guys, please give me like 10 minutes to build some defenses, please. I'm begging you. Let's put them all the way back here. Thank you very much. As a matter of fact, you gotta go. You gotta go. And so do you. This one, this one is so creepy. And it's not even all of them, guys. We've only spawned two of them so far. We also have a friendly frog. Wait, his name is Friendly Frog. Does that mean he will not attack me? Well, wait, wait. Is he gonna attack me? Oh, that's why they call him Friendly Frog. Because he's friendly. Wait, you can stay here with me, bro. He can actually go inside of the house. He's invited to the cookout. As a matter of fact, bro. I'm going to show you my favorite place in this house. You can chill here at the pool. He's supposed to be a frog, so I'm pretty sure frogs like water. So you should feel right at home. Come on, dude. You got you to gotta jump in the water. Uh, I guess we're going to control him. Holy crap, he's fast. No one tell me he can jump over the house. Why? 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 I'm not even going to ask. Uh-oh. I jumped so far up, I literally jumped out of the map. Oh, this is going straight into the wall. Oh, that would have been so sick. Hold on, we got a diving board? Wait, little friendly frog. You're going to have to try this. I know we're getting super distracted here, but this little tiny frog deserves to go on the diving board. <sighs> Come on, please. Okay, well, we're going to have to do this. The that was the wrong button. We're going to have to do this the hard way. There we go. That's way better. All right, let's see. Can we jump in the water? Dude, does that diving board actually give me a jump boost? Dude, I can see the whole city from up here. That's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Come on. All I want to do is fall in the water. This is the one. This is the one, guys. Let's go, baby. Smash like. All right, one more try. One more try. This is the one. I know. Oh, let's go. That was worth it. That was worth it. All right, uh, little friendly frog, you can stay in here. In the meantime, I'm going to check out all the other creatures and we're going to build some defenses. Make sure they can't get inside of our house. Are there any other friendly characters? Uh, a stick spider. Oh, oh my God. Oh, is it? What exactly screams spider about this creature? Don't spiders have like eight legs? Is he taller than the bear? Hold on. Let me see. No way. It's bigger than the bear. What the heck? This thing is terrifying. How? How is this a spider? The name is Stick Spider. I can see why they would call it a stick. I don't see why they would call it a spider, let alone a stick spider. Oh, who's faster? Oh, they're, they're a similar, similar, oh, I'm stuck. Similar speed. Oh my God. Close the door. Close the door. Do they fit through the door? Oh, they do not fit through the door. Hey guys, you're going to have to go. Get out of here. But y'all, I'm going to build some defenses. We're going to see if y'all can get through them. Probably not. Oh my god, this is creepy. So imagine I'm just chilling at home. I go up here. I just want to go out on the balcony. And then I see this thing. Yeah, you're going to have to go, bro. You just gave me nightmares for the rest of my life. So that right there is the stick spider. We also have the monster elephant. Oh, now this one makes sense, bro. It looks like an elephant without the trunks. It looks like a monster version of an elephant. So I know, I know why they call this one a monster elephant. This one makes sense. This one, not so much. If anybody understands why this creature is a spider, please let me know down below in the comment section. Thank you very much. So we got the elephant, a monster fit. Oh, heck, nah, bro. Hold on. A monster fish? Can that thing move on land? That don't make no sense, dude. There's no water. How is it moving with no water? Let me close this. Oh, oh my. Dude, it can't, it can't hurt me. Dude, look at this. It literally... <laughs> look at my character, bro. He's like... Get me out of here. No, but it, it actually can't hurt me. It doesn't even have any attacks. Maybe it can only hurt me in water so I can move. Wait, I don't have any attacks. Hold on. This thing is friendly as well. You know what that means? It goes into the pool. You know, oh, Yo! I, oh, I jumped into the neighbor's <laughs> bed. I'm in the back rooms. All right, let's just do this in a way easier way. I'm just going to spawn it straight inside of the pool like this. Just like that. Hey, look, frog, you have... I think the fish might have just eaten the frog. That wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> that wasn't part of the video. It is what it is, though. You know, it's uh, the chain of the nature. The food chain, whatever you may call it. Logistics chain, whatever it is, it's supposed to happen. We also have a monster giraffe. Oh, so this is supposed to be a gir giraffe. When I was playing the game, I thought this was supposed to be the country road creature. So a giraffe sounds pretty friendly as well. Is this thing friendly? Well, I hate giraffes now. Let's make sure we close that gate before it gets over here. Wait, where did it go? Oh my gosh! 
Oh my god. Dude, did y'all see that? It was waiting for me. Ain't no way that was AI, bro. This thing is sentient. This thing has a this thing can think for itself. This one's cursed. I don't like this one. It literally hit around the corner and now I don't have any gates. My body is here again. Maybe I should just throw my body inside of the pool. Let's see if we can do that from over here. Yo! Yo! Oh, not, not bad. Oh. I'm gonna need somebody to clean that. We're gonna have to build a new fence right here. A new gate, even. Um, this one looks pretty sturdy. Let's put this over here. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this should keep the giraffe out. Let's see. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Yup. Giraffe has been stopped. So you're gonna go back here. Let's see if there's any creature that can actually get through the gate. So that was a giraffe. We also have a monkey. Oh my god, that's so cool. It walks on its arms. Oh, it jumps. Oh, that's wild. Does it have any attacks? It does? Okay, so if the creature has attacks, that means it's not friendly. Wait, why is my body over here? It, well, it's gone now. Oh, what? My leg is... <laughs> what? How... Oh my, how is this not even possible? Let's get... Let's just remove my entire body. Thank you very much. Let's reduce myself to red paint. All right, so the monkey can run around. Tell me tell me this monkey can jump even further than the rest of the people. Oh. Oh, yeah. He's got the furthest jump. Oh, yeah. We're on the roof. We're on the roof we're gonna have to put some defenses on the roof as well because this monkey can easily just jump on top of there i'm gonna leave you right here a monkey a rabbit wait a ostrich there's no way this thing is is not friendly right oh yeah this thing is friendly let's go ba oh wait actually it has attacks hmm. hmm i'm not sure if this thing is friendly let's go ahead and find out are you friendly mr Alex? not friendly not friendly at all let's hurry up and rebuild the gates i accidentally removed them so you go right here and you go right here i'm pretty sure ostriches cannot fly so should be safe yes sir we are <laughs> you're gonna have to leave bro you're gonna have to go back here so we had the ostrich we also had the monkey uh a rabbit what's the rabbit why is the rabbit closing his eye hey there buddy are you there are you good hey there oh oh <laughs> The gate works against me. But at least even I can't get through the gate. That's good, right? All right, so the rabbit, it's kind of shy. So whenever you look at him, he comes and chases you for some reason. Uh, the monster smile cat. Whoa. Wow, what? The, we got a monster version of the monster smile cat. That is interesting. And then this one is the zookeeper. I think this is supposed to be a humanoid creature. That's creepy. Oh, my God. He's got a big butt. <laughs> you don't see that. Why is he walking? He can run as ha! <laughs> Funny as running animation, dude. So does he have attacks? He does. He can slap y'all around. Look at this. Oh yeah. Wait, can we make them fight each other? Let's see if we can do that. Do we have a faction tool so they don't fight? But if we do this. Oh, oh my god. Whoa! Dude, what? They all ganged up on him. Y'all see that? Wait, does this mean the zookeeper is on my side? <gasps> He's running away. Oh, nah. I'm setting up some more defenses. I don't know what you guys are doing. Get rid of my body. Oh, my. Oh, they're getting closer. They're getting closer. This can be good, guys. This cannot be good. So while he's fighting, I'm going to go ahead and uh, build some stuff right here. So we got the base system. We probably need this base controller right here. That's what we need. Uh, actually, we should put this inside of the garage. That probably makes more sense. I feel safer inside of the garage anyways. I'm gonna go inside of the garage. Are they still fighting? Yes, sir. They sure are. I'm gonna put this base controller right here. Just like that. Now, what we're gonna add first is we're gonna add a camera. So this camera will give us the ability to actually see what's going on outside without having uh, to risk our own life. So, we're gonna put this camera right here. Yep, that should be good. We're gonna have to link it to this thing over here. You know, it's all technical stuff. Also, we should probably spawn the rest of the animals as well. So, we already spawned the monster smile cat. We spawned the regular smile cat. We have the rabbit. So, we're going to go ahead and spawn the elephant, the bear, the giraffe, the monkey, the ostrich, and the stick spider. Oh, my God. These things are so cursed. Let's see if this works. So, we're supposed to um, switch to the camera uplink. Oh, yeah, now we can see them fight. Oh, <gasps> we have a hole inside of the gate. Oh, my God. Oh, I don't think the zookeeper stands a chance. Look at him. All of them are fighting him. Okay, we're going to have to hurry up with setting up the rest of the, the, of the, of the rest of the defenses. 
All right, so what we're going to add is we're going to add our stamp turret. This is an explosive. We're going to put this right here. So as soon as those things cross the fence, we should be able to just shoot them with a bunch of rockets. And we're going to add a bunch of guns over here as well. So a gun turret right here should be pretty good. I'm going to add one right here. Could probably add one right here as well. That's pretty good. Um, we can also add an alarm. Let's go ahead and add an alarm right here. So they actually pass by the fence. We should be able to hear it. We also get a laser turret. I don't know if these laser turrets actually work well. But we're going to add two of them anyways. Let's add one right here. And let's add one like right here. Now while we're at it, I think I'm going to add some more gun turrets right here. And right here, just in case. And then the last thing I'm going to add is I'm going to add a one more camera up here on top of the house uh, next to my body. Oh, well, there, there goes there goes the camera. Uh, I think I'm going to put it like right up here so we can actually see everything. Like maybe, maybe up here. Up here should be good. All right, just like that. Now we also need to actually give every gun some ammo. So we're going to give this. Wait, where did the Sam turret go? Wait, did I not have a rocket launcher back here? I really... What? Am I tripping? I really thought I had a, a rocket launcher. Oh, it's... I'm dumb. Okay, let's add a bunch of ammo. Okay, we gave it a bunch of ammo. Let's give this thing a bunch of ammo as well. That was the round button. This should work pretty well. Oh, it's already shooting. This thing's already shooting. Y'all see that? Oh, man, they're working overtime. Let's go, baby. All right. And then the lasers also need some ammo for some reason. What kind of what kind of ammo do lasers need? That was once again the wrong button. It works. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of this fence. We're going to get rid of this fence right here. We're going to run into the garage. In here. All right. Let's see. All right. Oh, they're fighting. They're going to. Oh, my God. They breached into the house. Oh, wait. They're all the way back here. Wait, they're going to the pool. Wait, we got the creatures inside of the pool as well. Oh my god, dude, I literally can't even see anything. That's wild. Oh, wait, a few of them are still stuck outside of the gate. Oh, hold on. This one is slow. Oh, that one got in. He got in. Y'all see that? Oh, they all they all got in. Oh, they're getting awfully close. Why is that thing not shooting rockets at them? Uh-oh. Why is he leading them to the garage? This can't be good. They're literally outside of the garage right now. I just probably Anyways, as I was saying, I should probably get a weapon. Right, this weapon right here this is the most powerful weapon. You literally cannot use this in unless you have admin powers. Ah, uh, we got one. Oh, we got oh my god. They didn't like that. <gasps> get back. Oh my god. Did y'all see that? We got multiple ones with one gunshot. Is there anybody else? Oh, yeah. Shoot him. Oh, we're doing it. We're oh my god. Okay, it was a it was a skill issue. I got like two frames per second. Obviously, I'm not gonna be able to get them. Oh my god, dude, my game is about to crash. <laughs> I'm pretty sure right mouse button actually sends out an explosion. Oh, oh, oh my god! Shoot him! Keep shooting! Keep shooting! He's going down! He's going down! Oh! <laughs> what the heck? Is he flying towards me in slow motion? violated right now and you guys can see we actually found a brand new maze in gmod this doesn't happen very often this maze is literally called the horror maze and i can kind of tell why it has that name it looks absolutely terrifying look how dark it is in these corridors oh my god wait a second what the heck is this okay we're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves we're gonna start exploring this maze, but we gotta make it a little bit creepy which is why i also installed all of the zoonomaly hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, NPC. So we're going to have all of these chasing us inside of this maze without us even knowing how to get through the maze. Luckily, we have a mini map. Not sure if that's going to be of any help, uh, but it is what it is. We also have these two buttons. This button is green. I don't know what that did, but I guess we're going to find out at some point. So who should chase us first? Let's go with the zookeeper. He's a, a classic. So we could go this way. We could also go this way. Oh, what the heck? I think I know what the buttons do. Hold on. So if I press this button, it turns.
turns off all the lights. Ooh, no, that's creepy. Let's keep the lights on for now. We'll turn them off later, but for now, I kind of like the lights being on. Right, so what the heck is inside of this place? Wait, the anomaly? Oh, they are chasing us. Do they know how to get through the maze? Oh, they do. They do. They definitely do know how to get through the maze. Open the door. Open. Open the... Huh? It's one of these types of mazes? What the heck? Oh, no way. It's like a little trap here. He knows how to open it. He knows how to open it. That's bad. Wait, but he doesn't know how to get through. <laughs> you dumb, bro. You don't fit through here. Let me close that for you. Oh, he opened it up again. Okay, so he doesn't know how to get through there. Is he going to figure out a different way to get to me? I don't know. The motion tracker stopped beeping. So I think that means... I might have actually escaped. Where the heck are we going to go now? Wait, there's a tower up there. Hmm. Should we go up on that tower? See what's up there? How the heck are we going to get up there? Oh, uh, hold on. I think I might be doing something. I might, I might be doing this, guys. Check the motion tracker. It looks like the zookeeper has no idea how to get to this part of the maze. Ooh, it is a tower. Why is there a... Oh! That Y'all saw that, right? I spoke too soon. The zookeeper actually does not know how to get through the maze. But I saw a vent in there. And I'm pretty sure I was able to actually open it and go in there. But now the zookeeper is also at the tower. So we're going to have to try and avoid him. I got a little bit ahead of myself. I thought, I'm going to be real. Some of these Gmod NPCs, they're kind of dumb. So I don't really expect them to be able to get through a maze like this before I do. But uh, I guess sometimes these NPCs grow AI or whatever. So he's somewhere around here. Keep track of the motion tracker. <laughs> it was funny. Wait, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't see any motion. Does that mean he's gone? <gasps> what the heck is he doing, guys? He's just standing there. What's up with him? Ugh, he looks so creepy. Y'all think I can sneak past him? I think he's trying to get through there. Hmm. I guess I know where we're gonna go next. Oh, I should probably in install this mod. Nobody wants to see this. What the heck? Don't tell YouTube about this mod. This is all just cranberry sauce. So there literally is a vent down here. Hold on. I want to see what's up on the tower first before I go down into the vent. So up here, we have a look at the maze. What the heck? You guys see that? There's an indoor area. That's that's scary. That actually scares me. There's literally nothing outside of the maze. So if we want to escape from the maze, I think the only escape is going to be through there or maybe over there. I guess I guess that right there, it counts as outside the maze. I just hit a spoon. Yes, I eat at my desk. Don't judge me. I'm a grown man. I can do whatever I want. All right. So now that we have a better look at the maze, it actually looks pretty sick. <gasps> Where's the zookeeper going? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm going. Oh, oh. You gotta be kidding me. He's, oh, dude, dude, I literally just saw him jump off the tower. All right, here's the plan. We're gonna rush to the tower. We know exactly what's on the top, so we don't have to go there anymore. This time, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go straight through at events. See where the heck's the zookeeper at? Ooh, where is he? <gasps> He's right there. Why is he just staring at the wall? That's, that's, that's creepy, Mr. Zookeeper. All right, I don't care though. Where does this vent lead? Ooh, it leads to the other side. Okay, I feel like that should have been obvious. But it's useful to know that there's a vent in here. Because I'm pretty sure none of these scary NPCs can get through here. Wait. <laughs> I don't fit. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I just had to squeeze it. Where'd he go? Uh-oh. That's a problem. It appears the zookeeper has disappeared. All right, let's get the heck away from here. Go through here. Oh, my. Oh, my God, bro. There's guts all over the place. Somebody clean up over here. Where did he go? I don't see him anymore, guys. I'm just going to leave him over there. We're going to try to find the start area again. And we're going to spawn. Wait, wait, hold on. I think I might actually be getting there. So behind this wall is the indoor maze. The scary indoor maze. Uh, I'm kind of... <gasps> Dude, it's right here. Are we going to go down there? I guess we are. Which NPC should chase us? I don't think Monster Bear fits in there. Nope. No, sir. We're going to have to get a smaller NPC like Smile Cat. All right. Let's go. Oh, 
my god, why is he so fast? Why the heck? Why is he so fast? Oh my god. We're inside of the maze. Dude, this maze is so dark, you can't even see it on the minimap. Wait, we're going in like circles or something. Oh, wait, that's a dead end. Huh? Am I tripping? Is this not the direction I came from? Dude, what? Huh? How is this? Something fishy is going on here, guys. How? Huh? 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 This maze doesn't make any sense. Wait, Smile Cat was literally behind me. Now he's gone. Dude, guys, I think the maze actually changes while you're in it. Oh, that makes everything way scarier. So where did the Smile Cat go? Did he get teleported? Yeah, this is actually kind of creepy. Wait, there's a button over here. Should we press it? Press the button. We're going deeper into this uh, cursed changing maze. What should we call it? This name, this maze should have a name. <laughs> this name should have a maze. Oh, no, this change. <laughs> Never mind. I had to reboot. Oh, there's even parts where you have to crawl under. What? Why is this here? I mean, it is pretty useful. If there's like a creepy entity chasing you. Like, we can just test it out. Let's spawn another Smile Cat. Imagine Smile Cat is just chasing you, right? You run, you run, you run, you run. You're like, ah! See this? He can't get under. That was close. Wait, where's he going? Does he know something? I don't... Go, 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 go! <laughs> Dude, the Zoonomaly creatures are so flipping fast. It's not even funny anymore. All right, how the heck do we get out of here without dying? I want to get off Mr. Spook's wild ride. Come on, guys. How do we get out of the dark maze? I want to see some sunlight or at least like fog or something. Anything except for this darkness. Wait, did we go in a circle? <gasps> wait. Wait, wait. Oh, oh that was a close one. I think, I think we might have gotten in a circle, guys. <gasps> Dude, he's on my heels. He's on my heels. We got to keep running. Motion tracker is going crazy. Please. Oh, I think... <gasps> Oh no! We locked ourselves in here! We gotta go back. Oh no, 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 no! Hey man, at least we're no longer in a dark place. Okay, at least now we spawned back here again. Which, uh, speaking of back here, so this is technically outside of the maze. So what's down here? Let's spawn a car, because this place is actually pretty big. Go ahead and spawn a car, and let's explore. Turn on our flashlight, I mean our headlights. So this looks like a ramp. Oh, never mind. Tell me that didn't look like a ramp, though. Tell me this didn't, didn't look like a ramp, but it was just the shadows. I thought I was going to hit a big air or something like that. So back here, we have a hole. There's a hole outside of the maze, guys. What's down here? Ooh, the lab. We got a lab in here. We even got the vents. Okay, let's check out the lab first. Can we open the door? Oh, no, the door is locked. Wait, how do we get, how do we get to the other side? Without cheating, of course. I'm guessing if we go down here. Oh, yeah. Now we're inside of the lab. Wait, no, we're not inside of the lab. All these doors are locked. Wait. These computers don't work. We can go up in the vent. Maybe that will lead us somewhere. Let's try this out. <laughs> Wait, we can't go up? I really thought we could go up. Wait, we can. Look, there's like... An opening over there. Okay, this maze is getting more interesting by the minute. There's a lab right here. We got to figure out how the heck we're supposed to get inside of this lab. I have a feeling the only way to get to this lab without cheating is by going through the dark maze. So I guess we're going to have to actually get through there. So I really want to know what's inside of this lab. I guess that's our goal for this video. We're going to escape from the zoo anomaly creatures. And we're going to try to get into that base right there. Will we succeed? Probably not. Will we try and do our best no matter what? Because it's about the <laughs> friends you make along the way. Yeah, that, 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 that. <laughs> what was he doing? Why was he just running around over there? Alright, we're going back inside of the maze, bro. We're going we're going back. Does he does he know how to open doors? No way, bro. No way he just opened that door. Oh no. Let's go. Let's try not to hit a dead end. That thing's still after me. Yep, yep. 
it's it's pretty close okay keep running it's so dark in this maze guys i gotta keep my flashlight on oh i've definitely been here <laughs> you guys can tell uh, <gasps> <gasps> go, go, it's a flipping dead end. <laughs> this maze, guys, is this this is the hardest maze maze of all time, guys. Look, my skull ended up all the way over here. Isn't that crazy? So we got Smile Cat in there. We got the zookeeper in there. Let's let's make it even harder. It's not like we're having a hard time already. Uh, one of my favorite ones from the game is Monster Bear. He just creeps me out. All right, Monster Bear, you definitely don't fit through here. I think. Let's find out. Wait, where? what is he doing? He is beeping. Why is he not going inside of the maze? Hold on. What's going on here, bro? Oh. Never mind. Never mind. You you do you. Does he not fit? Guys, I think he might not fit inside of the... He doesn't fit inside of the maze. Are you serious right now? He's so skinny, bro. He could fit inside my... Nooks and crannies. What? That's not what I I meant. I meant my nooks and crannies in my house. That's what I meant. Don't get it twisted. I don't know why I said that. That was crazy. But we're gonna make him a little bit smaller. So we actually <gasps> should have probably moved away a little bit before we did that. But hey, he fits now, which means I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> Don't mind me. All right. Oh, we're getting a bunch of beeps. That means there's multiple creatures on our tail. I haven't seen a zookeeper in a while. Oh, my. Dude, they're literally right behind me. You got to be kidding me. Last place where I saw the zookeeper was at the tower, which is exactly where we're going right now, according to our meeting. Ah, he's right there. Oh, whoa. Bullet dodged. Uh -huh. Let's go inside the vents. Let's go inside the vents. Go. I don't fit in the vents. I'm too fat for the vents. Are you serious, bro? Did that vent just fat shake? <laughs> oh my god. My body's right there. Did they see me from over here? <gasps> what the heck is bro doing? Why is he just standing there? Menacing me. Why do I look over there? The camera is this way. This is how scared I am, guys. Are we gonna make a run for it? <gasps> I can't believe we made it. That's wild. We made it, guys. That was insane. Let's go this way. Woo! MVP. We just we just outran them, guys. We just outsmarted them. That that was good. That was really good. Now we gotta figure out how to get back to the dark maze. Because we're gonna explore that and see if we can make our way into the lab. Oh, they can't get in here. This is good. There's like all kinds of This is not my blood. Should I be going this way, guys? I feel like I might regret this decision. What the Why is there a random chair right here? Just destroyed it. I didn't mean to do that. Why was there a random chair in that corner? Yo, don't tell me they call this a horror maze because there's actually creepy things inside of it. I, I thought it was just a vibe, guys. I thought it was just an aesthetic. But um, that chair, kind of creepy in my honest opinion. And I'm lost. I haven't seen I haven't seen the Zunomaly creatures in a while. And I think I'm more scared now that I'm alone than when I was being chased. At least there was somebody who cared about me. Even if it was just to kill me. Did I hear something? I, mu I, I must be losing my mind. I thought I heard something, guys. I'm getting paranoid. <laughs> I'm getting paranoid thoughts in my mind. <laughs> Let's go this way. I know the minimap is kind of cheating because I can see where the dead ends are. But for some reason, I still sometimes hit dead ends. They were so far away. I'm not even sure if the creatures can get all the way back here. Let's start running. Uh, this way. Where are we going, guys? Hold on. I think I see the dark maze on the minimap. Wait. Where's the entrance? That's what we gotta find. We gotta find the entrance. Oh, we gotta double back. Over. Ah! Why was the motion tracker not beeping? Why was it not beeping, bro? Ain't that thing supposed to beep when there's motion? Now, don't get me wrong, but I'm pretty sure that cat has some motion in him, man. I'm not talking about booty cheeks. <laughs> what? It don't matter, guys. We died again, which means we have to add another NPC. Which one are we going to go for? We know that Friendly Frog is friendly. Might as well just have him, just for vibes. He's friendly, so he can just chill inside of the maze. We also know the fish is... Oh, it's big. He's not going to fit in there. But he's also friendly, so he can... He's invited to the cookout. Okay, 
you can go in there as well but y'all so now we can actually add a creepy critter how about the monster giraffe giraffe i don't know why that word is so hard for me to pronounce okay let's throw him in here y'all get out of my way i'm going in there oh oh i forgot these ones they don't kill you but they do for oh <gasps> Did y'all see that? Bro was looking for me. Okay, we're supposed to get inside of the dark maze. How do we get there? Should be pretty close by. Um. Oh. Oh. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to find the dark maze. Wait, this is it over here? No. Wait. This is the exit. Again, we found the exit. But this right here is the dark maze. So we just gotta hug that wall. Hey, freaky frog! What are you doing out here? Maybe we're supposed to go this way. I don't really trust the motion tracker anymore because it failed on me. So I feel like this thing might be broken. If only there was a way to show NPCs on the minimap, that would make this like so much easier. Oh, whoa. Did y'all see that? There was multiple beeps. There were multiple beeps out there for me. <gasps> we found it. So what happened exactly? I went in here and then the entrance disappeared, which means this maze, it must be cursed or something. Like I walked over here. Like, I go. It happened again. You guys see that? It happened again. This is literally where I came from, and now it's a wall. That's that's weird. The maze is changing. A confirmed. We saw it with our own eyes. See, now I got another dead end. Like, this is impossible. How did I escape? Uh-oh. We're getting beeps. This can't be good. Is there something in here? Wait, but how do I know the dead ends are actually dead ends? Or if they will, like lead me somewhere else oh dude there's something in here with me do you guys see how big those beeps are there's like two beeps three three beeps i'm scared this way the minimap cannot help me dude oh wait whoa, whoa hold on this should not be possible wait we got a hallway like right here and if you look back here we got no, I'm tripping. I thought it was like a liminal space. Like, this wasn't possible. I thought this was bigger than what, like... Uh, man. I, I'm not smart enough to explain this stuff to you guys. Wait, wait, hold on. Last time we went through here, we got stuck. Let's not do that, because I'm pretty sure we left a smile cat in there. Four? What does this mean? The number four. Could that have a meaning? All right, this is the only way we can go. So that's where we died. Our body's still there. Which means there's also a smile cat somewhere in here. Let's try not to run into it. I feel like that's a good idea. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This can't be good. This can't be good. This can't be good at all. This way. Ooh. Okay. I think I think we escaped. Ooh. Another one of these things. Okay. I, f I feel like these things actually lead us somewhere. This way. The beeping stopped, which is good. I think we might have escaped. So we're not going in a circle. This way. Yo, 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 yo. Hold on. I think we found something. The light here is different. Hello? creepy just a random doll emitting red light in this maze nothing to be worried about sure i'm sure that thing isn't moving whenever you're not looking okay we have a problem i think i might have gone in this circle by accident i think i've already been here oh no let's keep the motion tracker out oh That was dumb. I didn't. I. I just couldn't believe there was actually something in there with me. And I saw those two beeps, and I was like, "Ain't no way they're in here." All right, guys. It's almost the end of the video. You know what that means? We're gonna turn off the lights. Dude, even my flashlight isn't working now. All right, this is gonna be real scary. We already got a bunch of these critters inside of the maze. We're gonna add a couple of others. We're gonna add the monster red. Make sure it actually fits. We're gonna add uh the stick spider. We're gonna make this one smaller as well, so it actually fits. And we might as well add ourselves a monster monkey oh my god we're playing this in hard mode uh we already got the ostrich don't we and the monster 
smile cap. Pretty sure all of these fit inside of the maze. Should we go this way or that way? I don't care. Oh my god, my body's right here. Okay, they're following me. Dude, my flashlight isn't even doing anything, guys. Mm, where exactly are we going? These things are really fast. I think the only way to really lose them is by going back into the dark maze and getting teleported. <gasps> Something in front of me. Oh! The monkey, the monkey has found me. I repeat, the monkey is out of the pocket or something. The monkey has left the sleeve. Oh, oh no, 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 no. This is bad. This is bad. Wait, I can escape. I can escape. Wait, this thing is friendly. You let them straight to me, frog. Why would you do that? Man, that was terrifying. Wait, they're actually gonna come after me again? Oh, what? What? I know what I'm about to do. I'm hopping in my whip. Wait, can I run them over? Ooh, 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 they're trying to get me. Oh, this is a bad idea. Why did I not just jump inside of the lab? I wonder if this car fits inside of the maze. Wait, let me, let me, let me turn on the lights, okay? Because we can't really see anything. Does this car fit inside of the maze? Let's find out. Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, that's a clean fit. Ooh, I just ran, just ran myself over. Oh, and I'm stuck. This was a bad idea. Oh, they're, and they're on top of the car. They're on top of the car. Surely if I, I if I get out of the car right now, nothing will happen to me. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, 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 he let them straight to me. All right, this time I'm going straight into the lab. And remember when I said there's no way to get in? <laughs> Let's do that again. Remember when I said there's no way for me? <laughs> oh! Remember when I said there's no way for me to get to the other side of the lab without cheating? Well, I meant that, but guess what? I'm a cheater. I cheat all the time. Watch this. Can they fall through here? Will they fall through? Nope, they don't fall. But wait, hold on. I think they might actually... They might be able to find a way to this lab. Let's go ahead and explore it. We've got an exit right here. Whoa, there's a bunch of... Bu what? We got cameras? We got a bunch of buttons. What do all these buttons do? <gasps> Different cameras. Huh? Did y'all hear that? What was that? We just opened something. Did we open a door? Okay, interesting. We should probably find where these cameras are. There's a bunch of other computers right here. And this right here, I think this might be the entrance. So let's see if we were right. Is the entrance to this lab, is it inside of the dark maze? <gasps> Whoa, this place looks creepy. There's two buttons. This one is red. This one is green. But you have to press both of them for this to open. Is that what this means? Oh, yeah. Back inside of the dark maze. Oh, this is crazy. Let's see if we can find the other creatures that we left in here. We're going to lead them straight to the lab. Whoa, what is this? It's like posters on the walls and stuff. Somebody else been here before me? This is the coolest maze map. Smash like we should use this map more often. No movement. I found movement inside of the maze. The movement is coming after me. I don't remember where the lab is. Oh! Did y'all see? Did y'all see how fast he was moving? Oh, go. oh, this way. This way. Come on. Wait, is it still coming after me? Wait, we should probably wait at the entrance. Is that thing still coming? Oh, what the heck was it? Why is it just standing there? Hey, you good? You stuck in the wall or something? You know what? That was so dumb and that made me so mad. I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, nuke this whole maze. Dang! We're gonna become every single tsunami creature. So let's start it off with my favorite one, the monster fish. The reason why is because uh, we actually have a lake right here and I wanna see if I can actually swim. So we go ahead and uh, take control of this character. We can also move on land, which makes absolutely no sense, but we're not gonna question it at all. What we're gonna do is actually just smash that like button and we can go into the water. Can we go in there? So will we actually float? Wait, we are floating, kind of. We are, nope, we're sinking. But then again, a fish belongs at the bottom of the ocean. Ooh, this place looks pretty good. So can I jump out like a dolphin? I think so. <laughs> oh, maybe a little bit more than a dolphin. This is like an airplane, a seaplane uh, even. All right, so this is the fish. So the fish is actually not hostile. So I don't think we can even do any kinds of attacks. Let's go ahead and try anyways. So if we're back on land and we try to do an attack, like just nothing happens. We literally don't have any attacks, which... Nah, 
You have teeth like this. I feel like you should be at least able to like chomp down on something. But you know, missed opportunity. We're not gonna complain about it, even though that's exactly what we're doing right now. Let's see. If we take control of the smile cat, we should be able to actually uh, attack the fish, which makes sense because cats love eating fish. So if I attack this one, nope. Uh, nope oh my god dude it might not be able to attack me back but it does have a lot of hp guys maybe i should spawn a few more small cats just as like reinforcements spawn like six of them let's see if we can actually eat this fish up come on guys with me guys oh they're not gonna attack the fish because they're all zoonomaly creatures yeah that makes sense that wasn't called for, bro. Why'd he do that? <laughs> Come on, dude. Just because I took control. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down. Calm down, guys. Chill. Jeez. Maybe I should get something else to fight. Because obviously, they're not going to fight one of their own. So instead of that, I'm going to go ahead and spawn some other creatures. What if we spawn some smiling critters? <laughs> uh, <laughs> let's see if uh, the smiling critters can fight the Zunamli creatures. Let's go, guys. Oh, wait. They're coming after us. Y'all see this? Whoa, hold on. Hold on. They're kind of strong. Y'all see that? What the heck? The smiling critters? <gasps> Dude, don't let them get too close. If they get too close, they will jump scare me and they will insta-kill me. Holy crap. That was insane. Wait, what happens if I spawn some more? Yo, that's crazy. So they actually grab you? Like, if I don't attack this one, it will grab me and kill me. Oh, that's wild. What does that look like? It looks the way you expect it to look. Um, don't, don't know what I was expecting there. Oh, it's coming after me. Hold on. Oh, it's really slow. I need a weapon. Stop or I will shoot. I will shoot. He should listen. We need something a little bit more dangerous. I'm going to spawn the military. Oh, yeah, that should be interesting. Now, which smiling critter, I mean, which Zunamli creature could take on the entire United States Marines? How about the zookeeper? Oh, yeah, that's the one. Let's see. He can run. Uh-huh. He can walk. He can strut. That's what that is. He can attack. And I'm pretty sure he can also jump. Woo! Oh, my gosh. That is so unnecessary. Oh, oh, we're getting shot at. Oh! Bop! Oh, oh, this hurts. Okay, come on. Come on, guys. Oh, they don't stand a chance. Holy oh, that one that one just hit me in the legs. Oh, that was a clean hit. Come on. I'm trying to dodge these bullets. Come back here. Come back here. Oh, what the heck? Did you just throw a grenade at me? Oh, they just went inside. I don't think I fit inside the door, guys. And you. Okay, one of them actually went inside, but I can't. Oh, is he dumb? Is he going to come outside? I can't hit him from back here. Oh, yoinks. Oh, oh, behind me. I thought I had all of them. Oh, is that it? This is the last one, guys. Uh, yo, that was actually I forget whenever I leave their body, which sounds weird when you say it out loud, they also attack me. I keep forgetting yeah. that. So the zookeeper, kind of a jerk <gasps> if you uh, ask me, but we're going to take control of him one more time. And this time we're actually going to have a whole army of Zunamli creatures to back us up. So we're going to have the smile cat right here. We should have the stick spider. Oh, my favorite one is probably the monster bear. I really like this one for some reason. Let's also have the monster smile cat. Uh, the giraffe is also pretty good. Monkey. I think the ostrich also has an attack. I'm not sure though. Should we just check? So the ostrich... Yep, the ostrich can also attack things. All right, that's pretty good. So are these all the hostile zoon zoonomaly creatures? I think so. Oh, wait, the monster elephant. I forgot about this one. Does this one do anything? Oh, my God. <laughs> He's fast. Look at him go. Holy crap. This is sick, dude. We could totally do a race. Should we do that first? So can he actually attack? Oh, yeah, that's clean. He can also attack creatures. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to have this whole army of Zunamli creatures or monsters, whatever you want to call it. We're going to go all the way to the other side of town, and I'm going to spawn some other creatures that we're going to fight. Um, Which creatures do we do? So obviously, we have the Poppy Playtime characters. Um... Uh... I don't know. I guess we could do that. We could have a catnap. We could have a nightmare catnap. We could have dog day. We could have a huggy wuggy. Kissy missy. Why not? Miss the light is kind of useless because as long as you keep looking at her, she's not going to move. So <laughs> what is she going to do? Right? And maybe boxy boo just for old time's sake. All right. So these are all the creatures that we're going to be fighting as the Zunamali monsters. Let's go back here. I said I'm going to take control of the zookeeper, which makes sense. All right, guys, everybody follow me. Uh no, I said follow me. You guys, you guys are you guys are going the wrong way. Okay, whatever. Oh, Kissy Missy. Wait, is she running away? Get her! Get her, guys! <laughs> Don't let her escape! Oh yeah, we got her. All right, the rest of them. Come on. I'ma go uh for nightmare catnap. Oh, what? <gasps> they got me! No way. No way they won. Wait, let me take control of uh old elephant buddy over here. Alright, so we gotta be careful. Don't get hit. <sighs> ah shoot! 
I got one of them, but Boxy Boo got me. Whoa. That is like watching a car crash. So hard to look away from this. What kind of jump scare did he give me, bro? I'm going crazy. Mr. Elephant, Mr. Elephant, you can... St <laughs> you can stop. All right, these two are stuck. Let's move them. Ugh. Dude, I think Nightmare Catnap might be stuck inside of the house. How do you get in there? <laughs> Ugh. Bro's actually stuck. Yeah. You know what we do to people that are stuck? We take them out of their misery. Bob. All right. So we catnap out of the way. I actually think the Zoonomaly creatures won. There's nobody else left. We did pretty good. All right. Next up, we're going to take control of the monkey. But, you know, this monkey doesn't really fit in this town. I feel like if I'm going to take control of the monkey, I should find a jungle biome or something. Biome. Why did I say that like it's Minecraft? This is not Minecraft. Yoinks. Because you can't do that in Minecraft. Ooh. You guys think I could jump on top of that bridge as the monkey? Okay, I can totally make it. I just got to time it correctly. Let's go ahead and make this a little bit harder by spawning some more monsters on top of the bridge. As a matter of fact, the biggest monster in the world. The United States military. That's a joke. Kind of. Uh, so let's just spawn a bunch of dudes up here. So what we're going to try to do, we're going to try to jump on top of this bridge, which, by the way, now that I'm here up close, I realize it's not a bridge. I think this is an internet cable. This is what connects your Wi-Fi to my Wi-Fi or something like that. I'm not a scientist, so anything I say probably is not true. I'm also a pathological liar. So keep that in mind whenever I say something and you believe it. <laughs> all right. So now that they're all spawned, we're going to go ahead and take control of this little monkey. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Can they even shoot me from up there? All right, this is going to be hard. Let's try it out. Huh. Oh, 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 oh my God. First try. First try. Ain't no way I just did that first try, guys. Ah, pff. let's go. Y'all, y'all got to leave. I'm going to kill you guys until my game stops lagging. Oh my God. Did they just jump off? Why would they do that? Why would you guys jump off like that? Oh, this is pretty satisfying. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. Stop shooting me. Check this out. If I attack this one, you can actually see him fly off. Nope. I mean, if I hit him, that is. <laughs> Woo! Oh, that looks painful. This one? Oh, they're sliding. Oh, 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 he tried to hold on. He tried to hold on to the thing. Oh, my God. Yo, the whole video should just be this. This is actually kind of fun. Watch this. Oh, he's going. He's going up. Yup. Dude, this one's all already off. I don't know how, how he's still alive. Can I just push him off? I'm on top of him right now. <laughs> this fell down like a Looney Tunes character. All right, I feel like now my game will probably stop lagging. You've got to go, and you've got to go. And so do you. Yup. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, you're done. You're done. You you guys might as well just jump at this point. Uh, uh, uh. But, dude, there's still a bunch over there. Holy crap. How many of these things did I spawn? Dude, some of them are literally jumping. Why are they doing that? Wait, they actually survive? Oh, now I get it. If they jump off, they somehow survive. Okay. Oh, look at this. Look at this. That one was falling and still shooting. Dude, a bunch of them still haven't died down there. Do you guys see that? All right. I know who my next targets are. I'm going to jump down. Wait, who's shooting me? Oh, watch this. Oh, uh, uh, ground smash. Uh, oh, that was wild. Oh, let's go. You're done. And you're done. <laughs> what the heck? Smile cat? Huh? I didn't spawn him. Okay, well, I guess we have a teammate. Oh, oh, these are the creatures I spawned when we were fighting the smiling critters. What the heck? How did they even get over here? That is crazy. All right, team, it's you and me against the world. So I said earlier, we're going to do a little race with all of the Zunamli creatures. I feel like we might be able to do one. If I just spawn all of them right here, even a small, tiny frog. Uh, I take it back. This one is my favorite. So we're going to spawn every single one on this road right here. And we're going to have them race. Now, I don't actually know which one is the fastest or if they even have any speed differences. But I feel like if these animals were real, the fastest one would probably be this rabbit, right? That's what makes sense to me. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to spawn... <laughs> One poor little guy over here. Who should we spawn? Let's go ahead and just spawn um Birdie. <laughs> Let's spawn Birdie right here. They're probably going to run here as fast as they can just to kill him. And um, I'm going to be doing the same thing. All right. Let's go. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, they got stuck. Wait, wait, a few of them. Wait, they're cheating. They're not on the road. They're not on the road. I win. I win. I was the first one of year. Y'all saw that, right? Let me get a slow motion replay. You guys can see it. I'm the winner here. And, you know, since I am the winner, we should probably also have a prize for me. Um, Let's make ourselves a little trophy, okay? 
So what we're gonna do, we just want a small tiny trophy. Like, um, this, this looks pretty small. Uh, it should be a different color. How about we make it, um, make it gold? Oh yeah, that looks better. Maybe we should also make it, uh, shiny. Can we make it Bruh. shiny? Oh, that's, that's not shiny at all. That's actually kind of weird. You know what? This works. I rock with it. All right, little bunny. Go ahead and uh, claim your prize. Grab it. Just go ahead and grab it. Go ahead and grab your prize. Why is he not grabbing his prize? Oh. I'm gonna keep it a buck 50. I thought I was gonna die. That was that was gonna be the joke, but uh, somehow I survived that, which means we're probably gonna need an even bigger prize. How about this one? You guys think I'll survive this one? It's already gold, kind of. So all we gotta do is make it shiny, but it's no longer gold. There we go. That's better. What do you guys think? You guys think we're gonna survive this? Let's put every single Zunamli creature around this prize. <laughs> like they're all gonna be around it. They're gonna be surrounding it. It's all our prize, guys. It's not just mine. I want this for every single Zunamli monster. Oh, this one is like hiding. You guys see that? Like hiding behind the tree. Ooh, that's kind of creepy. <laughs> this one creeps me out, which is probably why I like it so much. It reminds me of Siren Head. I'm gonna put this one right there. Come on, guys. All of you guys, don't be sore losers. I want fair and square. Oh, what did, what did I just do? I just pressed the wrong button. My bad, bro. I sent him to the Shadow Realm. I apologize. Doesn't matter. All right. Watch me claim my prize. Oh, my gosh. I hear hit markers. What the heck? We survived that one as well? That is wild. We can literally survive anything. I wonder. Oh, oh, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm not, I'm not making it. I'm not making it. <laughs> All right, that was a little bit awkward. How about this, guys? Instead of a bomb, let's see if you guys can survive natural disasters. We got meteors. We got tornadoes. We got whirlwinds, whatever that may mean. Let's go ahead and get the biggest tornado we can get. The EF5 tornado. That, that sounds pretty serious. Let's spawn that. Oh, oh, wait. I was still trying to get inside of the buddy. Let me get inside of the buddy first. Oh, my God. That's wild. Did you guys see how that tornado picked me up? Dude, it's literally right on top of us. That was crazy. Well, it's leaving. Let's spawn another tornado. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dude, we're literally surviving it. What the heck? This is not hard at all. Whoa. You guys see that? That looks so sick. Wait, what if we spawn a bomb right here and a tornado? What would that look like? I want to find out. We're going to spawn the biggest bomb they have. As a matter of fact, I'm going to spawn it. 20, 20 bombs. Okay, maybe not 20. Because that would literally make my PC explode and burn down my house. All right. We got three bombs going inside of the bunny. We're going to spawn the tornado. Everybody, smash that lickety like. Oh, what the heck? Nothing happened. Oh, whoa, whoa. You guys see that tornado back there? It's actually like moving. Dude, that actually looks good. What the heck? Oh, there's like stuff flying through it. I didn't even know Gmod had this, bro. That's crazy. Yo, let's spawn a fire tornado. What does that look like? Oh, my oh, oh, I don't know what I expected. I don't know what I expected. Whoa, there's fire everywhere. Yo, that looks so sick, guys. So what happens if it hits the bombs back here? Will the bombs get lit up? Let's spawn a fire tornado right here. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, my question just got answered. Oh, whoa, everything is burning. Literally everything is burning. The trees are burning. I'm burning. Oh, I'm getting hit markers. I think I might actually die. 